Hey chickies, okay today we're going bananas. I really hope you like it. Let's get into it. This is what you'll need and all the details will be in the description box as per usual. Start by painting a base colour. I'm just using a, a red which is Essie's Come Here and then using OPI's I Just Can't Cope with Cabana I'm painting a general shape of a banana. It doesn't have to be neat, in fact it's better if it's not. I know I say that a lot, don't I? That's how I get away with doing stuff not so great. <laughs> anyway, so paint your bananas and then let them dry. On the blue nails, again, I am just painting some smaller bananas. The blue, by the way, is Essie's I'm Addicted. Once all of your bananas are dry, come in with some black acrylic paint. I'm, that's what I'm using, but you can use black polish as well for this, but you need a very, very fine brush for, to do this uh, next step. So we're just going to paint an outline around the, each banana. And again, it doesn't have to be neat. In fact, it's better if it's not. There I go, saying it again. It's usually just a way for me to get away with doing stuff that's really crap, but it's not, no, no. Anyway, so the, the lines around your bananas really it, they wouldn't look good if they were really neat because it wouldn't look authentic or wouldn't look like give it that retro feel which is what we're going for here. And finally once your design is completely dry seal everything in with a good quality top coat. I'm using Sesh Feet as per usual and details will be in the description box. And that's it. I really hope you liked this one. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye, chickies. I want to thank you for subscribing and thanks for that delicious thumbs up. Bye.